Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Lauren, and in this video, I have a grocery haul to show you guys. I bought a whole bunch of food from Amazon and Whole Foods, and they are Hydra Supertiva friendly. And yes, I cannot pronounce the skin condition that I have, but yeah, let's get started, shall we? So, I filmed this all, this whole thing, and I forgot to show you the bacon. That I bought natural choice, no corn or soy. Um, yeah, I just forgot this one product. So. All right, next thing I bought was this yogurt, and I was not paying attention when I added this to my cart. It's dairy free, but it has sunflower in it and soybeans. Um, no sunflower, but it does have soybeans in it. Um, they have an almond milk version that, of this that you can buy, and I wasn't paying attention when I added this. I guess I'll eat it but it could trigger some symptoms. But there's an, like I said, an almond milk version of these. So, pay attention, Lauren. <laughs> All right, next thing I have to show you guys is this vegan butter. And I bought this because it has sunflower, it has sunflower oil in it, by the way. But I knew this wasn't gonna, this wasn't gonna be a perfect, perfect buy, if, if you will. Because, but I need, butter because oil when I cook eggs I notice that oil always makes the eggs stick to the pan and butter like the eggs don't stick to the pan so I just thought maybe a, a dairy free alternative might be a good option to try and we'll see if it triggers symptoms in me because everybody's a little different some some people don't like ha they have different triggers you know but yeah all right and I got another ooh, throw that over there natural choice meat Again, there is no corn or soy in it. These would be good for a breakfast sandwich with eggs. All right, next thing. I got myself some shrimp. Um, let's see here. Yeah, just it's good. I, sh I, I checked all the ingredients on everything before I bought stuff, but like I said, I made a mistake of buying these, so I'm just just making sure. Um, yeah, I got some shrimp. <laughs> I got these almond flour tortillas for tacos. Oh, Jesus. There we go. Yeah. Let's see the ingredients. Oh yeah, it's got like five ingredients. Perfect. The less ingredients, the better. Alright, and I got, I'll eat these turkeys. Turkeys, all, all that's in this is turkey and rosemary extract. Thank God, no corn. <laughs> Throw that over there. I got some chicken broth. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah, it's good. I, I mean, I like I said, I checked it all before, but gotta make sure. More chicken broth. Oh, this is the brand, by the way, if I didn't show it. 365. 365 has a lot of stuff that I noticed that I can eat, but not everything. And brown rice noodles. So I'm in this group on Facebook and this one nutritionist is like the admin. And I think rice is all on the list of things I can't eat, but she eats brown rice stuff and I'll have to ask her why. But I, like I said, I, 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 need, I need to eat. <laughs> I can't be 100% with this diet, it's impossible because there's so many things you can't eat. But brown rice is healthy and these brown rice noodles are really good. I really like them. Um, yeah. Another one. Mm. Alright, and these Laura bars. Okay, so not all of them um, are compatible with, this, with the HS diet, but I bought a few. Oh my god. <laughs> These two are, are good though. Yeah. Good little sweet snack, you know? Because you need something sweet to snack on sometimes. And I got a bunch of sliced carrots. Let's see the ingredients. Okay. Yeah. Alright. And I got this Alfredo, and I'll have to do a taste test of it because the reviews are, they're usually mostly positive, but there's a few reviews that are like, this is nasty. 
but it's dairy free Alfredo and it's from the Primal Kitchen I think yeah um, with avocado oil so I hope it's good but yeah I'll do a taste test I'll make some um, Alfredo chicken with broccoli and we'll do a taste test sometime yeah walnuts for yogurt only one ingredient walnut they got because sometimes with nuts um, they add oils to them like peanut oil or sunflower oil but this is just walnuts this brand Fisher just walnuts all right oh another Laura bar cashew cookie got a few of those throw this over there Is being a bitch. Oh, I got some oranges. I don't really like buying fruit that's not frozen because it goes bad because I don't eat it, but I do love these small mandarin oranges. I can't, like a full orange, like a huge, like navel orange, I can never finish, but I can usually finish one of these clementines or mandarins, I think. Oh, here's the, the brand. Oh, wait. <laughs> Here you go. Sun kissed. Oh, hmm. Alright. I got some onion. Yep, yep. And I got some bananas. Yep, just a few because like I said, I don't like buying fruit because it goes bad. So I just got three bananas. in this little bag. It doesn't have the ingredients on here, but it's, I'm guessing 365 is just chicken thighs. I'm always worried about hitting corn and soy, but I think this is just chicken thighs. these tortilla chips. I think they're almond flour. No, cassava, cassava flour, excuse me. Um, with avocado oil and coconut. Oh, it has chia seeds in there. I can't eat that. Well, like I said, you can't be 100%. This is, that's the only ingredient in there that is, has, is a lectin. So I'm going to eat it. Oh, ranch. They gave me ranch. Ew, I hate the ranch one. Oh, one of the regular tortilla chips. Well, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. <laughs> They're gross. Ugh. But the regular tortilla chips of the brand Siete. I'm pronouncing it bad. I'm sorry, but um, the regular just plain tortilla chips are good. But the ranch ones taste weird. I, they don't taste like ranch Doritos. I'll tell you that. <laughs> but these, these are really good. I really like these lesser evil uh, vegan puff cheese puffs these are really good let me just check the ingredients again oh there's watermelon in here that's weird I don't think I can eat that but like I said I need a snack okay because otherwise I'll get into my mom's snacks because I live with my mom right now um, and she gets angry at me so I need a snack <laughs> Avocados, yeah, you can eat avocados. Thank God. Ugh. Nothing here. I got this balsamic Primal Kitchen. Primal Kitchen is another brand that has a lot of stuff that I can eat. 365 Whole Foods Market has a lot of stuff I can eat. Um, yeah. Balsamic vinegar dressing for salad. I got, I also got, oh, is this more Alfredo sauce? I guess I got two of them. I don't remember ordering two, but okay. I got this garlic aioli mayonnaise from the Primal Kitchen again. Um, let's see here. What? I'm busy! Okay. 
And then I got this, I'm sorry, that was my sister. <laughs> I got this dandelion chai tea. I just like tea. I'm trying to quit pop as well as change my diet. So I really like this dandelion chai. Because dandelions I've read are really good for you, but dandelion tea plain is really gross and bitter, but the chai like masks it perfectly and it's really good. Yeah. <laughs> Not exactly HS related, but whatever. Oh, two bags left. Oh my God, there's a pile of bags in my room. What's this? Cauliflower, why was this in one bag on its own? <laughs> 365, yep. Broccoli, I love broccoli. I got two bags because I will eat them. Spinach, 365. I don't really know if you have to check like vegetables for any hidden ingredients, but I'll look at them later. And I got this cashew cheese. Cashews are on the list of things that you shouldn't eat on the HS diet, but I like cheese and this is a good non-dairy um, alternative and I will test it and see if it triggers anything but I'm probably still gonna eat it because it's impossible to do 100% like what would I eat if I didn't eat anything on that list <laughs> almost nothing and then I got this creamer and this is another thing that this is the only creamer I could find that doesn't have sunflower in it but it does have um, what else? Canola oil, which is something that you're not supposed to eat. But if if sunflower seeds trigger you, this is a good alternative. If and if canola oil maybe doesn't trigger you, because everybody has different triggers. Maybe I mentioned this already, but everybody has different triggers. Not every but everybody is, and not everybody is the same, you know. And that's it. So yeah, I have to put this all away now. <laughs> Well, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you got some ideas for um, some groceries you can buy. And I'll be making meals and stuff with these and showing you guys and doing taste tests and stuff. So that should be fun. Um, yeah. All right. Till next time. See you later.